What's up guys, welcome back to Ultimate MMA Plus, here with my assistant, pro fighter, Marissa Messer Balencia. Uh, back for some more boxing and kickboxing. We're going to add some kicks today, that's why I got the leg kick shield on and she got one uh, shin guard on. We're going to break this combo down just like we did the last time in three different parts and then we're going to put it all together for you guys as a drill. So make sure you guys watch the whole video. First thing we're going to do is we're just going to hit the jab cross hook, but we're going to go straight cross to the body and we're going to use a slip as we, we, we throw the cross. People have different names for this. Some people call it alley cross. Some people call it splitting the cross. I call it the cyborg cross just because I've seen Chris Cyborg throwing it. So I just like to name things after people. Better for my fighters to remember, right? So she's going to go jab. She's going to hit a cyborg cross to the body. And then just come up for the hook. That's just going to be uh, round one. Move around a little. I want her head out of the way of my counter. So if she, if she comes to the back pad, and I throw that cross, she's out of the way. And here. So, back up just a little. Yep, you can go to the back pad. You can go to the front. To the back. Whatever way you guys want to drill it. But the, the main objective is getting your head out of the way when you throw that cross to the body. Alright, so let's go. When you jab, I want you to step in. Come on this side. So I don't want you to jab and keep your feet there. I want you guys to close some distance on this. Yes. If you're not in punching range, then put yourself in punching range. Good. You want to make it a little bit more realistic? Jab to the back pad. Always keep that head moving. Good. This is going to be part one. I want you guys to drill that. One round, three minutes, whether it's on the bag or if it's on mitts. Either one. All right. Now what we're going to add to this is another slip after the hook. In case I want to counter that hook with my cross, she's going to slip. And with that slip, she's going to come back with the inside kick. All right. So we're going to go slow. Here, here, here. Then she's going to slip, then she's going to take a step, whap, and hit. All right, so after you slip, I want you to step your back leg towards the right and come in, boom, here, 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 boom, move this way a little. All stuff that I'm having Marissa actually work on in the next few months to add to her boxing. All right, so I'm sharing with you guys the stuff we're working on. Here, here, slip, whap, hit the inside. Slip, boom, inside. And she got the shin guards on, so you go, if you have shin guards on and you're going with someone, as long as they're not huge, I want you guys to hit that, that leg pretty good. Okay, let's go on this side. This is part two. I want you guys to spend a whole round just on this. Here. Here, slip, come back with the inside kick. Here, slip, boom, inside kick. Only thing I want her to do is step a little bit more towards her right. All right, here, step, boom, yes. Get some power on that. Boom. Good. That's round two. Now round three, I want you to forget about that for a second and just drill the cross hook and then drop the leg kick. I got the, the leg kick pad on so she can go full power if she wants. If you guys don't have one of these, put a shin guard on, but don't go full power if the guy's too big. All right. So just a nice little drill. Cross hook, take a step, boom. Cross hook, boom. Drop that leg kick. Always getting your head out of the way. Chop that, that leg. Chop the leg. Chop the leg. Okay, let's go this side. This is round three now. You 
Use your boxing and your kicks together as one arc. One more. Good. Now we're going to put it all together. All right, this is the drill that I wanted to work out to. We're going to go super slow first. So you're going to go jab, sideboard cross to the body, throw the hook, then we're going to slip, take a step, drop that inside kick, drop it down in the front, cross hook, boom. So slow. I'll back up a little as she's coming forward with the whole combo. Chop that leg. Good. Move around with it a little. So first round, we're going to go through it one more time. First round, just the hands. Get it good. First round. Yes. Nice and hard. Round one. Good. Round two. Add the slip, then come to the inside kick. And again, you don't have to put all these together when you're sparring. You can use each of these combos separately, but I just wanted to give you a drill to put it all together. All right, now we're gonna add the second slit with just the inside. Good, move. Good, drop that inside kick nice and hard. Good. One more. One on this side, uh, a couple on this side, so you guys can see both. One more. Good. Now, last, last thing was just the cross hook kick. All right. So this was round three. We got four rounds. Move around. Get this nice and good. Sometimes just throw those hands in the air. In the air. Just to drop that leg kick. In the air. Good. On this side. Keep that head out of the center line. Nice and hard with the kick. Good. Now, last last round, we put it all together. So, bop, 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 slip. This side. One more. Good. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoy this combination. If you like it, give us a thumbs up. Any questions, leave us a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Definitely check out Invicted.com, the last Phoenix Series tournament. If you guys want to see Marissa fight, she had two fights on there that night. So definitely check her out. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next week.